Hello, it's Brent Shard Leverage Lane back again with another macro video. In this video, I want to show you an Outlook macro that will allow you to create multiple emails all at once. Let's see it in action. All right, let me show you this macro by navigating to Outlook and heading over to the custom macros tab that I have to run the custom button for create multiple emails. When I click this button, an input box appears asking me how many emails do you want to create? Here is where you can enter in a number and then generate emails. I'm just going to enter in five. You can see if I just hover over five emails have been generated. You can see by default, all of these emails are blank, but the way I designed this macro is to really use it as a code template where you can get into the VBA code and start setting these fields for the two recipients, the CC recipients, the subject and email body. So let me show you what it looks like when you set up that customization. All right, after making some customization to the VBA code, you can run this macro again and set in the number of emails you want to create. And then instead of just seeing blank emails, you can actually see emails that you have pre-populated the fields for the recipients, the subject, and email body. And you can see the first three emails have been populated because of the updates I've made to the code, but then emails four and five are blank. So another scenario that you can do is you can actually remove the input box and preset the amount of emails that you want to create. Let me show you. You can see if I run this macro again, I'm going to avoid the input box completely and just get those first three emails that I've made updates to. Now in the example I explain in the description, let's say you've completed a task and you want to email the client to let them know. And that's what really could be this first email that's generated. You're just letting your client know I've completed this task and you can see that one time fee added to your upcoming invoice. And then you need to email your billing department. And that second email can serve as a notice to the billing department to add a specific service code to the client number to ensure they get that fee on their invoice. And then finally, you always want to keep your supervisor in the loop, which is why that third email can be used just to give them an FYI. If the client has any questions on their upcoming invoice, the additional charge is because of that service you just provided them. And there you go. This Outlook macro is extremely customizable, allowing you to generate multiple emails with just one click. I absolutely want to know what you think of this one. Check out some more Outlook macros. Thank you so much for watching. Stay awesome. Thank you so much for taking time to view this video. I really do appreciate it. If you want to start using the macro of seeing the video, I have a link in the description. If you could do me another big favor, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Stay updated on any new videos that I'm posting. Like us, follow us on all of our other social media channels, and as always, stay awesome.